Sea lions attacked by sharks right here in our local waters, four of them in less than a week. Yeah, two sea lions were bitten in Malibu, and the other two were in Redondo Beach. KCAL Lions, Greg Mills is live in Redondo Beach, has the story for us. Greg? And Jeff and Susie, the two here in Redondo Beach, one happened yesterday, one happened today. This is a word of warning for folks who are coming to the beach this weekend. <laughs> You go that way. She's moving and making some noise, even though she's a bit banged up. I think she was lucky. Lucky to be alive. This California sea lion survived a shark attack a month ago, washed ashore in Redondo Beach, and treated by Dr. Palmer here at the nonprofit. We do rely on donations. Marine Mammal Care Center, Los Angeles. They treat an average of 350 seals and sea lions here per year. Sharks are. Um, you know, they prey on sea lions. That's a normal part of the food chain. But here's the alarming part for sea lions and us humans. She was found wounded in a shark attack here in Redondo Beach. This week, two more sea lions attacked by sharks were found at Kings Harbor, also in Redondo Beach. Oh my God, we were just talking about this. About sharks? Yes. <laughs> this is for real, for real? Very real. Three sea lions attacked by sharks in a short time period along beaches here in the Redondo Beach area. With the sizzling summer weather this weekend, Jocelyn Hoon and her friend already have Redondo Beach plans, as do these visitors from Las Vegas. Are there sharks on the beach? <laughs> maybe, maybe. Maybe. There's a theory. Well, Susie and Jeff, got to tell you that uh, the sea lion that was being treated by Dr. Palmer, Dr. Palmer says that sea lion will be back in the ocean by, uh, by the end of this month, before August. Mm -hmm. Reporting live from Redondo Beach, Greg Mills, KCAL 9 News.